2.0. James Bond. More like James Bondage. <laughs> hey, uh, welcome back to uh, 2.0 of the show, you crazy cunts. It's your boy, Ken. <laughs> And, uh... And, uh, some other guy. Yeah, yeah, you know, just the host. Yeah. You know. Just, I gotta rescue... I gotta rescue some sausages and, uh, plant a... plant an insect on, uh... uh was that one too much of a stretch, or was the, was the sausages one too much? Well, whatever. I felt the entire thing was really forced. Yeah. Um, I think, uh, the, the show was funnier, um, when James was on... And I think we're doing overall a really bad job. No one's going to like, comment, or subscribe. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hey, it's the boat level. The boat level, yes. This is the water level. I'm so glad there's railing here, because if not, I would have, like, flown off the side multiple times. All right, where am I going? That would have been nice. What? <laughs> yeah, well, I already... Oh, I gotta rescue the hostages. That's what yeah, I'm Yeah, you, uh, you don't want to kill them. Um, I made that mistake the first time I played. Um... I'm not very good at following directions. So when it told me not Whoops. to uh, hurt the hostages, oh, yeah, you don't want to shoot that guy. Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him! Yeah. Uh, if you don't shoot him fast enough, they oh. actually just kill the hostages. I did not know that. So. Did I auto-fail, or? No, you you get, like, <laughs> you get, like, three fuck-ups before they kill you. Okay, cool. So, like, uh, you just lost another one. Fuck! <laughs> Christ! <laughs> yeah, so uh, just don't fuck up the next one, I guess. I'm not talking because I'm super focused. Yeah, I'm doing a, I'm doing a bad job of uh, carrying the weight. Yeah, um, well... Well, okay, Jesus, fuck. Well, you know, I mean, like, me. you know, not... I mean, it's not any worse than what I'm doing. <laughs> I mean, you know, I'm st <laughs> I'm playing the game, I'm focused, I don't... Never... I, you know, never played this game before. So what would you do if you had an actual license to kill? Um, that's, uh, tough... Tough call. Uh, and you don't know. I mean, yeah, I don't know. One thing you can I mean, do well, I mean, obviously, but like, I don't know. I think I'd, <laughs> I think I'd, uh, I don't know. I'd go like be a bounty hunter or something. I don't know. Aren't most bounties one of the life though? Shoot that guy. Well, <laughs> you're not very good at saving these hostages. The what? He died. Yeah, he died. Did you what? See, no, did you I didn't. See this giant message at the bottom that said "hostage executed." No, I didn't see that. I'm f so bad at this fucking game. <laughs> it's I'm so fucking bad at this game. We, I might just have to like switch over to you playing just so the game doesn't fucking. So like, I could probably tear through these levels still, even after my old age and all this time. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> hey, go through that door. Which door? Uh, the only door that's there. I thought I had seen a door at the top. I'm going to shoot that guy. There you go. Hey, you saved one! Now shoot the guy in green. <laughs> <laughs> you know, how funny, uh, or I mean, it's just not really funny, but... How funny? <laughs> 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 well, it's kind of funny now that you mention it. Can you imagine being like... Jeez, oh, I almost shot that guy. <laughs> But just, like, imagine just being the only hostage who survived. Like, all of your friends get fucking put, like, full of holes. And then, like, like the British like, Secret Service comes out and they're like, Yeah, yeah, job well done. Like, we, we saved one of them. Because you haven't failed the mission yet. Yeah. Despite four hostages being killed. Was it four? I thought it was three. Oh, yeah. In any case, yeah. I'm it was, not good at counting. It was yet. more than I should. Where, where am I going? Am I following uh, these guys? Like, turn around, do, like, a 180 from where that guy just ran out. 180. 180. Yeah, and I go through that door over there. Okay. Uh, there's gonna be a hostage in here. You're gonna save. Yeah. Yeah. Good job. And now, uh, cool. either one of these doors is gonna be more people. I think there might be more hostages, too. Nice. Right in the fucking lungs. Hello. Goodbye. Yeah. After this door, I think there might be one more. Nope. Okay, Whew. so now I just have to, um, 
Do we weave? want to go down to oh, no, the wait. front of the boat, so if you turn around. Okay, yeah, I just wanted to make and sure. go up the edge. Up this way? Yeah, uh, I think you're to the left. Yeah, down there. Is it this way? Yeah. And then go up through that door straight ahead, and then out through the front. Oh, I was, I was in the way. Um, yeah, it's a pull, not a push. Yeah. I thought that's... Yeah. And then downstairs. Okay. So at the very, very front, there should be a, a helicopter. There is. I, I'm dead. <laughs> I just walked straight into the fucking rotors. Come um, on, so you're going to have a tracking device that it's just like the camera oh, and like okay. the, the key copier. Okay, I thought I was trying to, I thought I was trying to get onto the helicopter. <laughs> oh, no. You're going to escape through this your... This one? Um, no. This one. Uh, no. the this one. Bug. Yeah. Okay. I am going to put this... Uh, don't miss this, by the way, because you'll fail if you don't get it on the actual helicopter. All right. Eh. There you go. Uh, now... So, turn right and go through the garage. It's, like, right in front of the helicopter. Okay. I need to get up on here. Okay, just auto puts me up there. This helicopter's got a huge fucking hitbox. I'm <laughs> going to go... Here, just go around to the other side. Yeah, that's, I'm working on it. Okay. And through that door to the left. Oh, man, what am I fucking doing? I've asked myself one? that multiple times. This door? Yes. How did that guy not fucking see me just... Merc his fucking buddy. <laughs> That's a good question. I ask myself that every time. I play. <laughs> you, <laughs> just like, um. Now what am I doing? This thing? Uh, no. Actually, oh yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say that's plastic explosive. Um. No, I think you're. I think you're done. I think you can go. Uh, go. Uh, you can go back to your uh, boat. Back to my boat. All right. And uh, just like fuck off out of here. <laughs> Ah, uh, yes. The, the boat mission. Oh, shoot that stuff. Uh, shoot shoot it? Yeah. Are you sure? Yes. Yes, I'm 100% sure it's already destroyed. And now you could just walk through it. No. Okay. Yeah, um, so the terrorists actually kind of, uh, set up all these bombs and took hostages. Uh, you know, so they had, like, levers oh, and stuff. Oh, I see. And you, uh, you blew up the engine anyway. Uh-huh. So, that's not gonna reflect well on your, uh, next evaluation great i don't know where i'm going <laughs> this is uh Unless you it out. it's uh oh, sh <laughs> <laughs> fucking <laughs> fuck <laughs> just right back where i started uh this game is um a little far away from my face honestly <laughs> it's tv my tv's like real far away from the couch that's not that far away it's, it's I mean not it's not it's not that far away, but also my the TV's not like super big either. Where I don't know where the fuck I'm going. <laughs> I am really so glad direction. these missions. You are so bad with directions. <laughs> like, not even like in the game too, when we were going to get food. <laughs> yeah, I I'm like I know where I'm going and then I didn't. Jim's like, oh it's a five minute drive from my house. Like it's just right down the road and turns right. Thirty minutes later we finally get there and it goes, Oh, I know what the problem was. I was on the wrong street. Yeah, well, you know, I, you know, it's, I fucking, it's down, I, whatever, man. <laughs> man, fucking, oh, it was good, it was good though. We got, uh, went to the ramen place. I got some ramen. We got, uh, pork cutlet, pork cutlet curry. And let's see, what's this next mission? Curry, more like hurry up to the next fucking mission. I'm <laughs> working on it. Break communications link to bunker gaining and blah 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 blah. Here, you do this mission. I'm gonna talk now. Okay. <laughs> Instead of being just dead to silent while I fucking run through this fucking game. All right, we're back in the snowsuit. Oh, it's the nighttime version of this mission. Sir, yes, sir. It's uh, can you see? Is there not? Uh, is there not too much glare from? No, the... there's no glare from me. I'm oh, good. really? Okay, I'm I'm sitting right um 
in front of a window, so I'm getting a bunch of glare. It's not that bad, but um, it also makes it hard to see the dark parts. Closing the blinds won't help either, because um, I told my dad we needed blinds in here, because uh, of the glare is bad. And what does he mm. do? He goes out and buys white pull-down blinds. <laughs> like, that doesn't solve the problem. It makes the problem worse, if anything, because now there's a huge white spot on the reflection of the TV. Joe, I don't know how to tell you this, but I think your dad is trolling you. I, you know, I... I think this is a really passive-aggressive way of saying he wants you to get out of the house more and stop looking at the TV. Well, I mean, maybe if it weren't for the fact that he got the blinds, like, years ago... I might, I so might. he already, so he probably already knew they didn't work. Well, <laughs> I don't think he understood that I wanted, like blackout blinds, and maybe not blackout blinds, but not like bright fucking white blinds to like, I don't know, mm. whatever. I mean, you know, I don't use this TV that much anymore. Even I, uh, a few years ago, I finally got a TV for my room. Uh, but my room is uh, small and poorly laid out, and uh, I had to put it up on my bookshelf at, like, a really awkward angle. So I have to, like, lie sideways on my bed, and my bed is a loft bed, which means it's, you know, got railing on it. So I have to, like, scrunch up sideways and lean kind of against the wall, but I have a wall scroll hanging on the wall, and it's just a fucking mess. Mm -hmm. And the TV's small, and it's kind of far away and it's hard to see and i'm trying to play halo on this fucking thing and it's you know it's like maybe uh it's maybe like a 29 inch or something tv the tv itself is nice it's just you know a little small because that's what we had to get to fit in that space right but um yeah it's just really awkward to use and uh it's kind of hard to see stuff especially when i'm like i'm like you know, you're playing Halo 5 and you get all these rec packs and they have descriptions and there's, you know, the little numbers of how many of each gun you have for online. And uh, you can't fucking tell what the numbers are because it's too small and it's far away. Mm -hmm. So I have to, like, every time I want to see how many, you know, what these guns I have, I have to lean forward and, like, squint. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it just, it's not, it's not ideal. It certainly doesn't seem like it. No. It's great for playing Minecraft, though, because I can just kind of lie there, and everything's big, so you can see it well. And it's, uh, That's pretty nice, I guess, but... Um, so, right now, I have no idea where, but there's a key somewhere. That I need to open the door in the for the satellite dish in the communications bunker and huh. I don't remember where it is. Great. It's Not like, like you can see anything anyway. <laughs> one of these fucking side buildings I'm like 90% sure. I mean it would be though. What? In one of the side yeah, buildings? Yeah it would be in one of the side buildings because why would they ever put it in the main buildings? You're trying to hide something don't put it in front of your fucking everything like main building well sorry you never know you know oh, you know yeah. there's like how many people's passwords like one two three four for like their birthday or something well yeah but i mean like this is in theory a big military operation or yeah something. but it's also a soviet operation so well all right that's fair <laughs> that's fair <laughs> remember ivan do not keep Explosives where you keep bullets <laughs> for fear of the explosion. <laughs> explosion? Explosion? Did someone say explosion? <laughs> Explosions? No, I mean, I said, uh, uh erosions. <laughs> oh, erosion. Yeah, the beaches. <laughs> yeah, you know. Do you not get the SpongeBob reference? No, I don't. Oh, all. there's an episode where, um, Squidward accidentally feeds Spongebob a pie, but it's not a pie, it's a bomb. Oh, and he's trying yeah. to keep Spongebob from finding out that he ate a bomb. <laughs> that was a good episode. Yeah. That was a good show. Yeah, it was a good show. I remember uh, I was in Cape May, New Jersey, and I, it was the, I, I don't know, it was like a, 
it was when the, the Hash Slinging Slasher episode came out. Oh, yeah. I had fucking nightmares about that shit, man. <laughs> oh, my God. I, uh, I think the... A nice model helicopter. It was. <laughs> it blew up! <laughs> what? I mean, that's giving a whole new meaning to the, the term plastic explosives. <laughs> um, I was going to say, I remember when um, the, uh, the, the episode... I don't know, it was that same episode with Nosferatu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, it's for uh, too. I had no yeah. idea what the fuck that meant. I didn't know what that was either. I, I thought they were saying something like, oh, you. I didn't yeah, I don't know. Like... But um, I learned later that um, some uh, it, there was some, like, I forget. It was, it was, like, one of those what the fuck fun facts or something. You know, the, you know that kind of, that kind of thing. Yeah, yeah. And it was like, um, yeah, so um, um, it's kind of funny that they used Nosferatu in that. Because uh, Nosferatu was a really like scary, fucked up movie, and yeah. uh, <laughs> and they referenced it in the fucking in this kids show, um, which was uh, I thought I thought was pretty like funny. It's like oh, that's interesting. Um, speaking of uh, old kids shows, did you hear they're bringing back uh, Animaniacs? Oh, I did see that. It looks uh, it actually looks pretty funny. Yeah, I think the I, I think the original like, like guy Steven Spielberg is, is uh yeah. is uh like an executive producer on that. Yeah, they uh, I saw an ad they did where they started it out like doing fucking Jurassic Park. You know, mm -hmm. they were like doing scene for scene the that where they sh where they uh, they pull up to the park and they're like, uh, hey, you know. Uh, it's really a good idea to do this, you know, whatever. This mm -hmm. seems like a bad idea. Then they see the dinosaur for the first time. It was that, but instead of the dinosaur, it was the Animaniacs again. And they're just like, oh shit, it's these guys. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, yes. And, um... And they're like, you're bringing the, bringing the Animaniacs back? And I'm pretty sure it was Spielberg himself. And he's like, yeah, I'm, I'm bringing them back. I, uh... I'm bringing them all back. And they go, all... Like, Pinky and the Brain, and whatever the other ones were, and he's like, yep, all of them. And I'm like, oh shit, that's really cool. I haven't seen Animaniacs since I was, like, well, let's, I lived in Colorado the last time I saw Animaniacs, and that was more than 20 years ago. Um, although there was that one movie they released in, like, the 2000s. Did you ever see that movie? Which one? The the there was an Animaniacs movie and they like they like Dot gets sick or something and she's like dying and they need to go like find uh, something to make a wish so they can cure her. That's all I remember. Oh yeah, I do remember. Yeah, oh, and man, like all the different cartoon like... characters from the series were there. I yeah. haven't seen that movie in like twelve years. Yeah, right. That movie was that movie was something. I remember seeing that movie a lot when it was on TV. Oh, that movie was so good. As far as I remember, at least. Well, yeah. I mean, you know, I, I think I, it was probably a good movie. Most of the stuff they put out was good. Um, that that was back in the era of cartoons. Being for kids, but also being for adults at the same time. Yeah, a cartoon's basically not giving a fuck. Yeah, right? Rocco's Modern Life and, you know, stuff like that. I don't... I, like, I was just barely too young to get a lot of that. But mm. I got, like... I remember, like... Um, Animaniacs, I remember. Um, Angry Beavers. Do you ever see Angry Beavers? Yeah, I remember that. Um... I think I saw a little bit of. I can't remember what that show was called, but you know, you know the show where they had, they were like monsters. Monsters. Was it the, actually the just called monsters? The monsters. The, yeah. Yeah. Where, where, well, there was that um. The, the one guy that had like his eyes were like yeah, he was he holding like, them in his hands yeah, 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 the whole yeah, time. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, it's the monsters. Yeah. yeah, I remember. I remember that show very vaguely. Um, I feel like there was one more. I'm forgetting. Rocket Power. Rocket Power, yeah. Um, I'm, I'm spitballing. Well, yeah, no, th definitely Rocket Power was one of them. Um, it was it was also, it was like around the time, the shows that were out around the time of like Rugrats and stuff. I remember that one. Um, 
Yeah, those were those were like some of the first shows I saw when I was a kid. And then, of course, I grew up on all the good Cartoon Network shit and good Nickelodeon shit. Mm -hmm. um, you know, like uh, early SpongeBob and uh, um, like old Powerpuff Girls and Dexter's Lab and all those all those shows. <laughs> you can't find the key, so you're taking your anger out on the door. <laughs> Pretty much, I can't figure out what the fuck I'm supposed to do anymore. Break communications link to bunker. Gain entry to bunker. Mm -hmm. I think you maybe you need to find like another building and like blow something up it, in it. I was like ninety nine percent sure this is where I needed to be. Is do you, do you have like a map that you can look at? No. <laughs> Oh, well, that's fucked. <laughs> that would be, that would be, that's really fucked. That would be far too convenient. And here you can see they've uh, taken security measures of getting rid of the locks. <laughs> yeah, the door's just, it's just there. It's just bolted on now. Or, yeah. Um, I remember always watching, uh, my favorite shows were Scooby-Doo and Courage the Cowardly Dog. Those were good. Great shows. Loved them. Oh, uh, Courage the Cowardly Dog gave me nightmares. Just the one episode, though. It was only one episode. It was... The one with the mummy guy, you know, the, uh... Return the slab. Yeah, that fucking guy. I had fucking nightmares from that episode. Holy shit. <laughs> Return the slab. Return the slab. Yeah. Yeah, I, uh, I remember that one. That one, that one messed me up. The one that got me the worst, though, was, um, the, like, the one where, uh, there was, like, uh, something living in the water. So Courage was, like, terrified to, like, take a shower or a bath or anything? Yeah. Oh. Hold on. There we go. <laughs> there it is. It took you long enough. That's what I was doing. I was running around this whole time looking for, like, a building that I missed. God damn. These motherfuckers came in squad D. Holy shit. Yeah, right? You open the door, there's just, like, seven of them. And they're like, sup, bitch? <laughs> Hope you brought your body armor. But yeah, like, uh, I, I love those shows. Um, Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy. That was a good one. Do you remember, I remember like the old, like the pilot episodes for that, like the Grim and Evil stuff. Oh, um, yeah, yeah. Where they had Evil Con Carne. Yeah, I remember that. That was, that was real old. Didn't Evil Con Carne used to start out as like a, like a knockoff for like a, um, I think I was going to There you go. Um, I I don't remember if it was supposed to be like a knockoff of something. All I remember is originally it was Grim and Evil, and they had shorts that was the Billy and Mandy, and then they had Evil Con Carne, and he had the bear, um, like mm. Bosco or something was the bear, I think, or Boskov or something. I don't remember. But yeah, a big yeah. purple bear. Yeah, yeah. And he was in the bear's brain, and his stomach also could talk. That. Um, Dude, and then it, they dropped the evil Concarne part uh, and was just Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy but occasionally they'd have like a crossover kind of thing where like the uh, the fucking the, Scar Scar, General yes. Scar. Scar he would show up in Billy and Mandy and uh, get tortured by Billy <laughs> just you know as usual <laughs> Yeah, these were great shows. Yeah. Cartoons these days are garbage, but, you know, also we're adults now, so. I think the last good cartoons that were on Cartoon Network were probably Adventure Time and Regular Show. I don't know. I've seen uh, episodes of Gumball, and that show is fucking bonkers. Yeah, I mean, so my opinion on Gumball is I think it's well written, and I think it's, like, it does what it does very well. But, um, um, I am not a fan, personally. Hmm. I, I noticed that, or the, uh, one of the times I was over and, uh, Richie was playing it in the morning, mm -hmm. I was watching it and, uh, I, I noticed, like, a trend of, like, kind of jokes that they like to do, mm. and I'm like, oh, they're doing this joke again. They're doing the everybody screaming joke again, or they're doing the, mm -hmm. you know, whatever. Yeah, so. I, had, I had only ever, uh, oh, you know what? I'd never noticed before. Um, you're in like a, a jail cell right now. Yeah. 
and there's a bunch of bullet holes in the wall. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Never, never noticed that before. Right now. Um, but yeah, I've only seen like I don't know, maybe like ten episodes, so it seems pretty, pretty interesting, pretty cool to me. Um, Over the Garden Wall was pretty nuts too. Oh yeah, I, I did see that. That was a good one. It was great. Uh, even though it's not, even though it was like a, a short. Like, yeah. Not a short, but a limited series. I mean. Yeah. So is this a new mission or? Is... This is a new mission. Oh okay. Well, whatever. We can do one more mission, and then we can call the episode. But because we're also in, you know in the middle of a decent conversation. Um. <laughs> Hassan Chop. There we go. <laughs> Fucking um. So the, the way I got out of there was you have this um, <clears throat> magnetic watch. Oh, cool. So, you, you sucked his keys up? Yeah. Um, you can also... Oh, fuck, I, I accidentally... Um, turn it off. Here we go. Boom. Ooh. I don't know why a bunch of knives were sitting at the bottom of a well, but... That's pretty cool. They were. This bitch empty. Yeet. <laughs> can you pick them back up? Oh, you can pick yep. them back up. I mean, it makes sense, but, like, <laughs> um, fuck. I, uh... Oh, my God. All right, fuck this. <laughs> my... I think the... The... Of the most recent, like, Cartoon Network, like, the good ones, uh, I guess their, their recent, like, big three, I guess you could call them, Adventure Time, Regular Show, and Gumball. I think Adventure Time was my favorite. I, mm. I like, I liked Regular Show, or, like, I didn't dislike regular show, but, like, I wouldn't really watch it. Like, I wouldn't go out of my way to watch it. If it was on, and I'd, you know, I'd, I might watch it. Because um, I thought it was pretty good, but they all got, like, every episode was, like, weird as shit halfway through. A regular show? Yeah. Like, yeah, and they um, start out normal, and then, like, at the end, they've summoned some elder god that's mad at them for doing something, like, not cool or something like that. Which is, you know... Yeah, I, I never I never really liked regular show all that much. I had friends who were like who swore it was like the best show that uh, Cartoon Network ever put out. But to me, it was just like, yeah, I, I mean, this feels like such uh, college stoner humor. Yeah. And I like I liked the weird um, like Dungeons and Dragons kind of humor of Adventure Time way more. Yeah, Adventure Time was my favorite. Um. I, uh, they, it ended, what, last year? Maybe year before? No, I think it was a couple of years ago now, actually. Um, but they're putting out specials now on HBO Max. The first one's been out for a while. It was alright. I mean, it followed BMO. I don't really like BMO that much. Mm -hmm. You know? Um, there's a cool, uh, cameo by one of the other characters that it's they don't really like tell you it's this guy but like it's very obvious like, did you have you seen it yet um i did i did i just watched it like literally last week yeah. um are you talking about uh, that it was a uh, finn's dad yeah yeah that's the one yeah yeah uh, i because i like i i thought i recognized his voice and i was like oh, i'm not really sure but uh, no it makes a lot of sense yeah, between the voice and his habit of like stealing shit and you just fucking <laughs> <laughs> this dumb bitch. That's why I always leave her in her fucking cell. Oh my fucking god. Oh my god. <laughs> All right. Fuck her. She deserves to be shot. She won't wait in the fucking line of fire. You stupid ginger bitch. <laughs> yeah, god damn. Oh my god. Oh my god. All right. We'll pick this back up next episode. <laughs>